Hello and welcome to another video in LEGO Fortnite. In today's video I'll be showing you how to make the Ninja Turtles base in Fortnite Creative. It's pretty easy, you know, fairly simple. I'll be showing you how to make cool sewer water and you'll just get some general tips. But yeah, this is how to build a Ninja Turtle base in Fortnite Creative. So, materials, you'll need some floors and stuff from the Slappy Shores floor gallery. You'll need these uh, stairs and floors from the abandoned fortress gallery and then a bunch of these pieces from the cool citadel wall and floor gallery. Alright, so, uh, yeah, once you get these, we're gonna make this part first. So, first thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna load up an island, build up a couple pieces like this, some walls so you're above ground, and then you're gonna wanna make a nice 2x2 two two with some floors from the Slappy Shores gallery, and then grab a wall and kind of just like place the walls like this here, like what I'm doing. All right, and then grab the floor, and we'll select it and place it down by one, move it down by one and then place it. Then we're gonna grab this edge piece and we're gonna place these um, on the walls. And then we're gonna pick a section and we're gonna just place one in the middle, place these border or these corners. And then we're gonna grab the corner and uh, increase the height by 5, the width by 5, and the depth by 5. Then we're going to put this on the other side, and then we're going to increase the height by 5 for this one, and the depth by 5. Alright, now we have a full stairs, so we can put some furniture here, but here's how to build the rest of the base. So, grab this piece from the fortress, and then You'll be placing these down, just like so. And then place some blank ones with no lines. Then I'd recommend deleting these two, placing these two down. And then, if you want, you can place some here, just like this. All right, now put this on the other side. And then you'll probably have to extend that. And then we're going to grab this piece and we're going to place it here in the middle, just like so. Alright, uh, and actually we're going to delete these because I don't want those anymore. So, we're going to grab these stairs, we're going to place one right here, just like this. Then we're going to grab this piece and we're going to place that one there. And then, since I don't like how that looks, we're going to go on build the prop off, mirror this piece, then go back to build the prop on, and we're gonna place it down just like so. Alright, now we're gonna grab this and we're gonna put it right here. And then we're gonna put one right here. And then I'm changing my mind, we're gonna actually move it there. So, let's do that. We're gonna grab this piece, shrink it down by five, and then we're going to just put it here, just like so. And then we're going to just keep placing them down. Just copy what I'm doing here. We're going to just place them down like this. Alright. And then once that's done, we're going to put... We're going to grab this archway. We're going to shrink it down by 5. We'll place that down. Then we're going to grab a wall. We're going to shrink that down by 5. Place that down as well. Then we're going to place the stairs. Just like so. There's this one here. And this one here. And we're gonna put like, uh, you know, anything there. But now, we're going to put some floors down here. We're gonna add a corner and then we're gonna put the more floors this way. All right, now for the wall. So grab this piece, corner piece, and then, you know, uh, place it there and I extend it out like what I'm doing here. And then grab this wall and shrink it down just like the corner piece by five. And you place it down all the way. Okay, and then grab the one that doesn't have a dirty bottom side and uh, shrink that down by five and place it. Then do the same thing with the wall, shrink it down by five and just place them down. And then once you have that all done, you can select the whole thing and place it up a couple times. 
just like that. All right. Once that's done, I'm gonna grab wall, place it, um, or like reset the size, and then place it just like this. All right. Once that's done, you know, grab the less dirty wall and place them down, and then I'll put it just like that. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, once it's all like that, I'm gonna level it just like that. Okay, so, you know, it, look, it will look cool in the end if you just keep going. So, I'll show you how to make those rooms next. So you grab the archway, increase the width, and then go on pitch, rotate it once, then start placing them down, just like about like three times. Then grab the, uh, the wall, normal wall, and place one like about here, and then one here, and then grab this wall, or bring the wall back over here, go on to this now like 32, and like just kind of place it, line it up, and place it just like this. Then you're going to go through like that, and um, you know, place it down. And then I just, I'm going to just place some... Uh, more walls down because we're going to put this on the other side so select it grab it and then move it onto the other side too just like so boom all right now grab this piece this floor and extend out the floor and then once you have the size of the room you want just kind of build a box and then put whatever you want in there. I don't know what to put in here, so I just kind of put that kitchen and the flower, the uh, cherry blossom tree or whatever in there. Um, but now for the corners to make them look nicer, uh, grab this corner piece and you know shrink it down by five on the width and depth, um, and then increase the and uh, keep the height the same. But just like that, there you go. And then for the roof, grab the same piece. Um, you want to change the size so it's long enough, like this. And then try and even it up with the walls. So use the lines on the walls to kind of as a guide. And then place them down. Just start placing them down. And you see the Z fighting, but just ignore that for now. Okay, now grab this piece increase the width by like five and then you know get it to be lined up with the thing and then just like line it up there you go okay once you have that now grab a wall and then just like flip it and place it just like this. Alright, now grab one of the pieces here. And like, we're going to want to just rotate it and put it on the other side. Just like so. And then we're going to grab this piece. And I'm going to actually move it so it's over here. And then make sure it's all like balanced and stuff, you know, it looks good. Alright, then we're going to grab this piece, the one that goes with the corner, and then we're going to like rotate it accordingly, and we're going to, you know, just place it down, uh, just like so. Then we're gonna just uh, move it all down, as you can see. And then we're gonna put it on the other side. We're gonna grab this and put it on the other side. But first, we're gonna go off build the prop. If it's on, it should be on. And then we're gonna mirror it like we did with the stair piece. 
and we're going to then go back onto build the prop. I just put it on the uh, the piece here. Make sure it's all lined up, and then. Okay, once it's all lined up, you'll just want to multi-select and then just place it all down. And then boom, if you have gaps, just fill them in and then multi-select that whole thing and put it on the other side. Just like this, as you can see, uh, you're going to want to make a thing. And then grab this piece, you know, and start like filling in gaps you know like put some fillers down and stuff like this and then um, put the walls down if I can we'll put this on the other side then and then we're gonna place a bunch of pipes on the walls like a lot of pipes and stuff like that on the ceilings and the walls and then for the sewer water which is really easy and looks really good we're going to grab this murky water from the elemental gallery and then we're going to make it bigger and then we're gonna grab a light device yeah. take this color make sure um, the shadows are on cast shadows are on and then we're gonna make it like a point light we're gonna make it big and stuff like that and then we're gonna put it under the water and it looks weird with one but if you have multiple it looks really cool just like that and then you can use this light you know in here or in the room stuff like that and then yeah it looks really good in the end and you just start decorating here and but you're done you've built the thing if any of this made any sense so if it did, uh, thanks for watching, and use code just a frog in the Fortnite store, and make sure to subscribe and like and whatnot, all that good stuff. So yeah, bye bye.